today we take a drive just down the main road from Huahin all the way to Sa'am. Let's see, let's just have a look what we see on the way. Or short, Sirinton Park. Uh, this park is free, it's actually paid for by the Queen so that uh, students and everybody really can learn about nature in Thailand. Let's have a look. So all around this area, there are many different trees, all of which have different purposes. And there's small explanations around it. So some trees are just for shade, some are for food, some for medicine. And you can just have a look around and they're arranged so that you can learn more about it as you walk along. This area is where rainwater is collected before it flows into the sea and it's supposed to have an abundance of plant and animal life. So there's a wooden walkway through the whole area, but um, well, you can walk on it. I don't fully trust it. It doesn't look very well maintained, but as of now, um, you can get around safely. As you can hear, it's so quiet here and you always hear some animal, some fish, frog or crab in the water or some birds, but we never get to see them, so we're going to try a bit more.
so far we've only seen termites and now I hope we can also get to see this one animal that I always wanted to see and it's the mud skipper. We keep looking, but the mud skippers are nowhere to be seen. It's the same I want to see, it's a mud skipper. Mud skipper. Mud skipper. They can walk on land. You still see it disappearing right there. So finally managed to see a mud skipper. Just just barely. Sorry, in the video we didn't capture it that well, but at least had a glimpse. Small flock. What a big one. We've been here for almost two hours, I think. <laughs> so it's time to have some water and go to a place where there's some wind. How is this one? เยอะมากเลยเขาเรียกปลาอะไรคะปลาซิวอ๋อหูเยอะมากเลยอ่ะเ
If you like this video, please subscribe.